sell your Bitcoin now. Sell all your cryptocurrencies now. If you don't do that, you will definitely regret. Hello everyone, this is Chester. Thank you so much for watching my video. Today is the August 1st, 2024. After the past four days, the Bitcoin price have already fall below from $70,000 until now it's $63,900. So which means Bitcoin price have a huge, huge, big sale and a lot of people selling their Bitcoin. There is a lot of reason recently. And also now, do you think the Bitcoin will stop the, 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 the dump? No. The Bitcoin price will reach $50,000. Maybe in uh, one week or two weeks, maybe in one month or two months later, but it will. And yesterday, uh, this morning, okay? This morning we can say that um, the FOMC, the meeting uh, have already finished. So um, as already we expected, the FO FOMC said that they will remain the interest rate. So which means the interest rate the interest rate is still very high, more than 5%. So in the market, there is not too much money in the market, and there is not too much water. So so in, a, in, in, in this way, and the uh, GP Morgan said, if the FED chooses to keep uh, this way, the data will allow it to to make, it the, make the interest rate uh, lower to cut the interest rate in September. So now it's the August. And September is only uh, one month or two months later. So, which means this one month, the Bitcoin price will be lower and lower and lower. So if you don't sell your Bitcoin now, if you, if you still hold the Bitcoin, still hold your bag, you will lose money, right? And also, um, there is one uh, very bad news is the, uh, for the South Korea's CEX, the sex, you know, uh, centralized exchanges will begin paying regulatory fees with an estimated total of about two hundred and twenty thousand dollars. So, on August first, with the implementation of South Korea's Virtual Asset User Protection Act, virtual a virtual asset service providers such as Abit, Bitham, and Coin One will also begin to pay regulatory fees. Regulatory fees are levied based on operating income, and the total amount is expected to be 300 million won. Uh, that is uh, around 220,000 US dollars. The regulatory sharing fee of virtual asset service providers will be calculated based on the operating income and sharing rate of the previous operating year. Based on the sharing rate in 2024, Update's fee is about 272 million won. And also, Bithumps is about 36.5 million won. And Coin1 Con and Gopax also has a huge, very too much fees. So the actual collection of regulatory sharing fees will be implemented from next year. So a lot of people, a lot of money will be paid, okay? A lot of money will be paid using uh, the four the purpose of regulatory fees. So in the market, there will be less and less money. So the Bitcoin price will be cheaper and lower, the price will be less. The price will fall down, will fall from the highest point to the lowest point. Only the uh, most fear, the most fear BTC holders, if they sold their BTC, you can, can you imagine what, what is the price will become for the Bitcoin? $40,000 or $45,000 maybe? But in my own personal opinion, I think in the near future, the BTC price will reach $50,000 because the gap haven't been filled, okay? So today, now I have to f finish my video now. Um, and also if you have any questions, please feel free to subscribe my channel and leave in a comment. At the end of this video, I have to mention that all of my video, all of my groups, and everything I said is only my personal opinion. No matter what you do, no matter you sell or buy, no matter you long or short, there is no relationship between you and me. I am only a 
stranger for you, okay? I'm only a YouTuber with not too much subscribers. So if you want to support with me, please kindly subscribe this channel. And also, please remember, now it's very dangerous for the cryptocurrency world because, you know, so um, hold your back and protect your own money. And also, nobody will take responsibility for your investment. Nobody remember. So, um, just a grown up, okay? Bye bye, see you later.